Oswin. Where's Oswin? Anyone seen him? I believe I saw him heading to the stable. What? Fire. You blind? Nobody willing to put it out? Ain't that simple. Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable! We've got to say- Hey guys, welcome to the 39th Let's Play of Witcher 2. Here we are. We're gonna go... Um, I guess we should read about the botchlings. Let's go read about- Oh, first of all, we are at a jello alert level zero. He is at work, so there's no risk here. Um, is there anything- No, I don't want to steal from the guy. So we're gonna go directly. Oh, wrong one, wrong button. Let's go to the glossary, then down to the bestiary, and let's look at botchlings. All right, they're a cursed one, obviously. Botchlings. Same, but botchlings ugly is like saying shit's not particularly tasty. Can't say it's a lie, but it doesn't exactly convey the whole truth either. Lambert, Witcher of the Wolf School. Botchlings are perhaps the most repulsive creatures a Witcher will ever have the displeasure of meeting. Born of dead, unwanted babies, discarded without a proper burial, their appearance is that of a partially decayed fetus. Their, un their unformed flesh twisted with hate, fear, and malice. These hideous creatures feed on the blood of the pregnant women, driven by mad hunger that most often leads to their victim's death. Ooh, they're vulnerable against... Oh, oh, it tells you what they're vulnerable against? Okay, let's... Cursed oil, okay, and then Axie. Okay, cool, I did not... Oh my god, I should have read that sooner, guys. All right, so we're doing fa some more family members. Let's go talk to the Baron. Let's get on the horse. Come on, come on, horse. Come here, Roach. So, guys, I'm going to hop on Roach if he doesn't quick getting locked up in these tree can i get up there hey, roach can roach thank you so i'll see you guys at the bear okay evidently i came across a monster nest hey how you doing ghoul you know yahtzee's right i basically just use quick strikes on this that's all i pretty much do it's pretty much all i do yeah okay so we got a couple more let's clear out this nest <gasps> i just blew myself up guys that really sucked all right, let's pick up loot, though. Ooh, very nice. Any more stuff? Yep, we got more stuff to pick up. Well, no, I guess that's pieces of an explosive barrel. So, that didn't go nearly as well as I had kind of hoped. But that's okay. Poor dead guys. Poor dead guy. Anybody over here needs anything? Ought to just destroy it. Okay, so let's destroy the ghoul nest, I guess, guys. Oh, I guess we do need to do it quickly, too, because evidently ghouls are to keep spawning. Okay, we got rid of the ghouls. Now we need to go take care of the ghoul nest, ghoul nest. ASAP. Out of justice. Okay, guys, as it turns out, I'm not going to mess with that ghoul nest anymore. I got my butt kicked. Let's meditate a little bit more, get a little bit more healed, and then we're going to go see the Baron. Evidently, I can't figure out what I'm doing sometimes. So I'll see you guys at the Baron's. What do you say? We hit the high road. Castle's on fire! Uh-oh! Oh, shit. Castle is on fire. Hey, Paul! Hey, Paul! Flee! Let's... Quick! Hey, no! Paul. Hey, Paul! The stable's on fire! What? I gotta get up there, guys. Everybody out of my way. Quit crying. Just do it. Get out of my way, everybody. We gotta go fire. rescue the castle, because the castle is on fire. 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 House is on fire. Oh God, what's gonna happen now? Who lit the candle? That's what I wanna know. Who lit the candle? Oswin, where's Oswin? Anyone seen him? Believe I saw him heading to the stable. What? Fire, you blind? Nobody willing to put it out? Ain't that simple. Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable. We've got to save him. He'll burn alive. Him and the horses. Oh, I'll try. See what I can do. Hurry now, quick. Yes, I am. Oh, my God. I guess we're rest and I'm on fire. Okay. I think. Let's try getting up here, guys. Gotta hurry. I am hurrying. All right. Come on. Hey. There we go. Come on. 
Where is the little kid? I'm coming, kid. I'm come. I'm coming. Coming. There we go. Can't get out. Roots collapsed. Coming to get you. Come on, Oswin. Open the main gates to the stables. Okay. Where's the damn main gates? Do something. Okay, so I guess I have to go through here, guys. That's what we're gonna try here. Open! Open the door! Oh my god! Yeah, it was me trying to open the door, guys. In our midst, you've earned yourself a barrel of Lyrian. I know your wife miscarried. Was that before or after you beat her to a pulp? What the fuck are you suggesting? Don't play me for a fool. You'd been beating them for years. Finally, they'd had enough and fled. Sound about right? Ah! They ran from you, didn't they? Lying prick! <laughs> A bloke with bullets to stand up to the battle hall. Ha ha! You can't face me! You can't see me! Yeah, I did that hand motion in front of my face, guys. We need to talk. I guess I have his attention now. Huh. Sit down. You beat them. I never laid a finger on Tamara. Not once. And on Anna. That's another story. She always knew how to spark my ire. Expect me to believe you were a loving father to Tamara after that scene in the courtyard? You're free to believe whatever you wish, but she was always the apple of my eye. She had the run of the place, ask anyone. She'd ride the horses, hunt with the men, at times join them on their rounds. And they'd send for her when I flew into a rage. For only she could calm me. Make it sound like she led a charmed life. If that's the case, why'd she run? I'd hardly need you if I knew. Your wife. How'd she make you angry? Too much salt in the soup? Socks never darned? Twenty years we've known each other. She's seen me drunk and sober. She was there to greet me when I returned the victor. She was there to patch me up in defeat. Like no other, she knew where to press, where to pinch, so it would hurt. You beat her? For that? For criticizing you? Ah, oh, Witcher, you haven't a clue, have you? Well, perhaps I shall tell you about it one day. One day, but not today. You knew they had run away from the start. Yes, I knew. Why didn't you tell me? Wasted my time. Say I had. Say I'd said I had troubles. Couldn't control my wife, my daughter. What kind of flaccid prick would you take me for? Tell me everything you remember about the day they fled. The truth this time. I'd been soaking myself three days straight. Anna came to me, said they were leaving. I begged them to stay. She refused to hear it. I tried to stop her. She wriggled like an eel. We struggled. She fell. Last blasted thing I remember. Woke up in the morn, breeches heavy with my own piss. A large bump on my head. Sadly, they were gone. 
Know what that's like, Witcher? No. How the fuck could you? I was left with nothing. Nothing! Only the bottle. Signs of a fight in the room. Hole in the wall, wine all over the landing. Was that you? Oi. We tussled. She tried to whack me on the noggin with a candlestick, but kept missing. Hit the wall and the pillar instead. I staggered backwards onto the table, spilled the wine, slipped and tumbled. Anna used that moment to flee. She rushed down the stairs, still clutching that damn candlestick. I caught her on the landing. We fell. I, I thought I had her. Then she turned and smacked me in the head. I blacked out. Don't know what happened next. When I came to, I was alone. Tomorrow present for all this, she see you quarrel. Through the doorway, perhaps. She didn't enter the room. Shame, too. Things might have turned out differently. The sight of her always calmed me. What happened next? Next? It only got worse. I awoke at sunset, not knowing how many days had passed. Thought it was all a plowing, drunken nightmare. And then I went to the bedchamber, but Anna was not there. Instead, there was blood everywhere. I knew she'd miscarried. My breath short, my throat locked. I neared the bed and saw it. It lay there, a tiny thing, defenseless, on bloodied sheets, dead. And it was my doing. Maybe you're doing, maybe not. But that amulet she wore could be important, or maybe the fact that she lost it. What did you do with the child? What was I to do? I took it out and buried it. Just like that? Damn you! I gave no thought to a funeral. It was a horror. I wanted it to end. That child had been my dream. I told Anna, the little one, our little one, to make things right. Yet she died before she could be born. Understand, Witcher. My child was dead. I sympathize. I do. Thank you. And know that I hope you find your Siri. Deal we made means I need to find Tamara and Anna first. Just so happens your unborn daughter might help us do that. What? How? Sometimes miscarried fetuses, if they don't get a proper burial, turn into botchlings. Into... fucking what? A cursed creature that draws strength from killing pregnant women. Once it's strong enough, it attacks those who scorned it. But how... how does it know? Blood ties. They're a strong bond. A bond I want to use to find your family. How? One of two ways. Legends claim you can bury a botchling under the family's threshold, perform a ritual and turn it into a lubberkin. That's a sort of, uh, hob. A guardian spirit that could lead me to your family. And the other way? We kill it and draw some blood. Take that to the Peller and he does the rest. Do not kill my child. It's suffered enough already. Lift the curse that it may finally rest in peace. Still not sure what to do. Whatever you decide, we must put an end to my child's suffering. Whatever we do, we gotta find the botchling first. I'll show you where I buried her, and I'll dig the grave at my threshold. If it turns out we can't transform the botchling into a lubberkin, they can bury us in it. Handy either way. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight, at midnight. Then wait here with me. Near midnight, I'll take you to where I buried her. Get word to the common folk. Ought to stay in their homes tonight and draw a line of salt outside their doors. And try to sober up. Do I take a shovel to dig up the grave? 
Take it. You'll need it, but not for that. A bit further. Follow me. Okay, guys. That's where we're wrapping up the 39th Let's Play. I will see you guys next time. What a horrible, horrible husband. I'll talk to you later. Take care. You were expecting me. Aye. As the bones declared I should. They shall come whose stench is ripe and death, but the wolf shall disperse them. The white wolf. And thus he comes. Omens never lie. <laughs>